Bosch invented the automotive oxygen sensor in the late 1960s. In 1976, the Volvo 240 260 series became the first passenger car fitted with this new component. Some 45 years later, the oxygen sensor, also known as the O2 sensor or the Lambda sensor, is a vital part of the vehicle's fuel and emission control system, and it's hard to imagine a vehicle without them. In fact, oxygen sensors are required on all gasoline engines and most diesel engines around the world. So why is the oxygen sensor so important? Well, the answer lies in a concept known as lambda equals one operation. When lambda equals one, a gasoline engine is running at the ideal or stoichiometric air fuel ratio, which is needed for the engine to achieve perfect combustion. For gasoline, the stoichiometric air fuel ratio is 14.7 parts air to one part fuel. And that's where the oxygen sensor comes in. The oxygen sensor measures the oxygen content in a vehicle's exhaust gas. The sensor reports this information to the engine's computer system, ensuring that the necessary corrections are made to the air-fuel mixture. The main function of an O2 sensor is to help maintain efficient combustion without being too lean or too rich. Simply put, oxygen sensors are the most effective way to monitor and regulate the combustion process. Since automakers began installing oxygen sensors on vehicles in the mid-1970s, they've become an indispensable tool to control harmful emissions. Coinciding with the mandate for OBD2 systems on all vehicles built since January 1, 1996, all vehicles built since 1996 have required multiple oxygen sensors positioned both before and after the catalytic converter. Typically, wideband sensors are found before the catalytic converter, while switching sensors are found before and after the catalytic converter, depending on the application. The typical life cycle of an oxygen sensor varies based on the sensor's design. Oxygen sensors with one or two wires have a typical service life between 30,000 to 50,000 miles, while three to five wire sensors have a lifespan of up to 150,000 miles. Checking and replacing worn out oxygen sensors has become a critical part of regular vehicle maintenance. Signs of a failing oxygen sensor can include a malfunction indicator light, engine performance issues, lower fuel efficiency, and excessive exhaust emissions. It's very important that your customers replace their oxygen sensors at the first indication of failure to optimize fuel efficiency and emissions and to prevent long-term damage to a vehicle's engine and catalyst while reducing harmful carbon dioxide emissions and saving money when refueling the vehicle. I'm Josh Cable. Thanks for watching.